Hey everyone, so today I'm going to show you what's on my dresser. I know yesterday's video I had a little bit of what's on my dresser and stuff like that. Um, I showed you what's in my little like roundabout sort of thing that I hold my makeup in, but I thought it would be fun to show you all the stuff that I have on my dresser because this is where I get ready in the morning and this is where I have like the majority of my skincare and makeup and stuff like that. So um yeah, I'll just start with backing up to show you guys like the overview. Um this is just my side. And if you back up even more, this is all my side, my glorious side of the room. Um I just have a lot of like pictures and stuff like that. Some fun things, thing, thing, things, things that mean stuff to me, um, inspiring quotes and stuff. And this is one of my favorite quotes, and I love seeing this every day. Also, my um, lamp is from Target. I got that when I started college, so freshman year, I got that. So that was 2010. Oh my god, that was so long ago. And my mirror is from TJ Maxx, I believe. Okay, so we'll just start over here, I guess. Um, I have my, like, bedside thing, and I have my, um, Rose Sal from C.O. Bigelow, which I'm trying to finish. This is my last one. I finished another one, um, just a week or so ago, so I'm trying to finish this one. Some hair ties, some naproxen sodium, oh yeah, headache pills. Um, I have this, um, Sustain, like, eye drops, if your eyes are dry. This is the eye cream that I'm currently using during the daytime. It's the Naturoderma Black Rice Eye Cream. And I just want to finish this because I don't like it that much. My Rimmel Gentle Eye Makeup Remover, which is my favorite. I have a pen sitting down there. Um, the Cetaphil um, Lotion for Dry Sensitive Skin, which I use during the day. I have the La Roche-Posay Anthelo 60 sunscreen for the face. I honestly haven't been really using that recently because I haven't been going outside that much, which is uh, good and bad, I guess. Um, back there I have the Certain Dry Deodorant, which is a really strong deodorant and you use it at night. So there's that. I'm almost done with it. Um, I have my little sample perfumes and then I have like nail clippers and some change that I like found or like the the dime that I have in here my grandma found and I just keep it around Ugh, I can't get it out anyways you guys know what a dime looks like um my grandma found that like on the ground and she almost like took out her back trying to pick it up so I'm keeping that um I have this evil eye bracelet and yeah just basically perfume samples Back here I have this picture of me and my little cousin Dougie on my birthday, my 19th birthday, two years ago, and I have like um, fortunes stuck in the side. I love fortunes and these are just some of my favorite ones that I like to remind myself of. Here I have this Noir Tease Body Spray from Victoria's Secret. I have a sample of the Basha, Bashia, I don't know how to say that, um, Bright white mask. Back here I have, let's see, the DKNY Be Delicious Fresh Blossom perfume and then the Heidi Klum Shine perfume which I really like and my all-time favorite perfume which is the Vince Camuto. Then I have my nighttime eye makeup remover, which is the Harman Face Val Values Oil-Free Eye Makeup Remover. It's like a cheaper version of the Neutrogena, and I think it works just as good. I have this Elizabeth Arden Clear the Way Mask, which I got at Marshalls, and I used it yesterday, and I really liked it. So, yeah, love it, and it was like 7 bucks or something. Here's a sample of the St. Ives Apricot Scrub. I think I used that once. I got that, like... Always look for free samples online because that's how I got that and that's pretty awesome. Deodorant, basic. Um, I have my Junk Drunk Shot Glass with some lip balms, baby lips, and then this um, Hugo Naturals one. I have my EOS lip balm and then I have my Corez Pomegranate Lip Butter. 
Here's my e.l.f. Kabuki brush. I just washed all my brushes, so I'm really proud of that. I have my Mario Badescu Special Cucumber Lotion, which is a toner. Beverly Hills Decade Peel Exfoliating Serum. Um, Opti-Free Contact Lens Solution. My Polish Choice 2% Beta Hydroxy Acid Gel. Um, cotton Rounds. Then in this, like, pencil case, or pencil holder sort of thing, I don't know, is this little, like, drawer divider, I guess. I have most of my hair products and then some skincare as well as my um, eyeliner. Okay, so that's the Urban Decay Zero Eyeliner. This is the Rimmel Exaggerate, and here's my little um, brush that I, like, put, uh, like, shadow over the liner. Then here I have the Mario Badescu Silver Powder. Behind that, I have some samples of skincare. I have two Orlane products and a Caudalie. The Orlane products are absolutely amazing and divine, but they are so expensive, so I'll never be able to afford them. I have this um, Bobo Sremi um, leave-in conditioner spray. The John Frieda Brilliant Brunette Liquid Shine, which I really like. Um, L'Oreal El Net Hairspray, which smells disgusting. <laughs> Um, Nexus Touchable Hold um, Finishing Mist, Ambi Fade Cream, which I honestly haven't been using like at all, and the Nexus Mousse Plus. And then next to that, I have this little sample thing from Evology, which has the um, blemish serum and cream, which was also a sample I got for free online. And this stuff is pretty good for like combating acne. Okay, then moving into this like swirly thing which I showed you guys most of it yesterday, but here I just have my face face brushes. I have um, an Eco Tools one and the rest of them are, are um, e.l.f. Then I have my nighttime eye cream which is the IQ Derma um, Restorize Firming Eye Cream and my Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Concentrate which is my nighttime moisturizer. And then down here I have my makeup missin set which I haven't been using much, but it's still there. All of my eye brushes, um, mostly like e.l.f. I have a MAC 217, Sephora, here's the Delium Tools, and here's um, a Laura Mercier. This is the Secret Camouflage um, Concealer Brush, but I use it for gel liner, so that's a new way to use it. Okay, moving on, I have the Maybelline Eyeshadow in Linen and the L'Oreal Hip Quad in Shady, which I use for my eyebrows. Then I have my um, Physician's Formula Healthy Wear in Translucent, Translucent Light and um, the Laura Mercier Primer, just the foundation primer. Here I have scissors, um, Magic Lumi Concealer by L'Oreal, and my concealer, would, I mean, not my concealer, my mascara, which is the Revlon Grow Luscious, and also my tweezers. Then I have the NYX HD Base and Barely Beige Color Tattoo by Maybelline. And then my Candy Coral Blush and Too Faced um, Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. Oh, and also I have this Y2 Tooth Comb, which I use to brush my hair. I have the Dove Dry Shampoo, which I love. Here I have a... You can't really see because there's all this other crap in front of it, but... Let me pull it out. I have this um, Nutella jar which I got when I was in Spain see euros two euros and 15 cents I don't know I forget what the currency is there but um yeah this is a Nutella jar which I got when I was in Barcelona and I have some like plant filler in here and I have like one of my baby lips I have my um, Jimmy Choo roller ball elf retractable lip brush and then my eyelash curlers Okay, so quick funny story. Um, I filmed most of this already. I filmed up to this point and then my roommate came in and so it was like sort of awkward and I guess my finger was over the microphone so you couldn't hear me say anything. So I was all nervous and filming in front of her for nothing. So now I'm just gonna show you the rest of my stuff on my dresser because I didn't wanna cut that out because it was like the majority of my stuff. So um, let's see, I have my um, Sephora Manic Matte Lipstick in number 9, which is really nice. Um, the Trina Tarantino, um, what are these called, like conditioning lip shines in Cameo, which is a great nude color for pale girls. 
This is the Airy Quenchstick in Dawn. They discontinued this like years ago and I wish they didn't because I love that. Here's the foundation I'm trying to use, um, which is the Almay Smart Shade. Then I have the L'Oreal um, Studio Secrets Primer. These are all things that I showed you guys yesterday. Um, stuff that I'm trying to like use and not neglect as much. Then I have like cotton swab swabs in this little pot, um, glass thing. I have this Vichy toner that I want to use. And I made a dent in it if you can tell. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. Um, so yeah, working on that. Here's my NARS Ondine eyeshadow. My Laura Mercier duo in um, Plum Spice, which I use because it has a really great mirror, so I get like close up to do my eyeliner. Here's the Sephora, um, what are these called? Uh, Prismachrome eyeshadow, and it's in Divine. Then I have my Aura Fluido um, Deep Sea by Ulta, Rose Gold Lip Gloss by Revlon. I have this quad, The Temptress's Gaze from the Project Runway collection by L'Oreal. These are some great neutrals. I have a sample of the Balm Staniac, which I have gotten a lot of use out of. I like that a lot. Um, here's my Dr. Jar BB Cream, which as you can see is getting kind of gross even since yesterday, so I should probably just throw that out even though I love it. Um, I have my All May Smart Shade Concealer, which I'm trying to use. A Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye, which is a great full coverage under eye concealer. And then moving on to stuff that isn't makeup. Well, here's my washcloth, which I use to like wipe off brushes in my hands and stuff. Um, my contact lens case. And this um, divider I have all of my jewelry in. So I have all my earrings. Then moving on to like necklaces, some bracelets, um, rings. And I got this divider at... Um, Michael's, the craft store, and it was on a really good deal. I really love it. Um, makes me feel like I have a jewelry store, but I'm not going to be able to go through all of my earrings. You've seen a lot of them in videos. Earrings are my favorite accessory, so I have my like little Betsy Johnson and um, Trina Tarantino compartment here, so... Um, that's that, and then I have these, like, glow sticks that my dad gave me for the Halloween party I went to, but, um, they had some there, so I never ended up using them, so I'm just, like, keeping them here. Um, I have a hair clip, the, um, little Hello Kitty jar that I keep my bobby pins and hair ties in, and then I have my list of videos to do, and I always have, like, a post-it notepad somewhere around because I'm always, always needing to make mental notes and list and stuff for myself. So I hope you guys enjoyed this, and, um, I wish you could have, like, seen my, um, video when my roommate came in because I felt like so nervous. I was like sweating so much, but um, you couldn't hear me at all. So what's the point of showing you guys that? But um, yeah, I hope you guys are all doing okay, especially if you were affected by Hurricane Sandy. I know all of my friends and family at home they don't have power and thank God we still have power where I am at school. So we're very fortunate and I hope that you guys are like safe and warm and can find somewhere like that does have power to spend the night or anything like that if you don't have power where you live. So um, I love you all so much and I will hope to talk to you soon but who knows with my crazy schedule but it's already like the middle of the week which is kind of crazy and school hasn't even started but we do have school tomorrow so rambly ending as always but um yeah I'll speak to you very soon. Bye!